Hi, all you SPMEs out there. Today's topic has three points we're going to hit, and you're going to want to stick around because the third point is a secret as to why keywords can be the deciding factor between whether you win or lose with self-publishing. So let's get into it. Today's topic is on why KDP keywords are so important. Now, this is something that many authors, when you first get started, completely ignore. This one thing can make such a huge difference. And when you first start getting into the world of writing books and self-publishing, you begin to understand and hear other people talking about keywords. But you're not sure whether it's something that you can ignore or maybe you need to be paying attention to. And this is a huge mistake if you choose to ignore them like so many self-publishers do when it comes to putting your books onto the market. And that is what we're going to discuss in today's video. This is Chris Baird from selfpublishingmadeeasynow.com where self-publishing doesn't have to be so hard. Hit the subscribe button if you'd like for me to make more videos like this one and check out below in the description and grab a copy of my absolutely free self-publishing checklist to make sure that you are not skipping any of the steps you need in order to succeed at self-publishing. So let's get into it. When I first got started with self-publishing, I had never even heard of keywords. What exactly are keywords? So this was something I was completely unfamiliar with. But then after I started using hours and hours, possibly a hundred hours or so of learning uh, the importance of keywords by listening to podcasts, YouTube videos, reading books and blog articles and participating in forums, I began to understand that keywords were something I should not be ignoring on my books. And what happened was I had ignored them completely on my books. So I went back and changed the titles and the keywords that I was using to make sure that they were much more profitable. So I also, in addition, learned about a tool called KD Spy, which you can find my affiliate link below in the description. It is the tool that I use personally to figure out which topics and keywords I should be using in my books. So, and those keywords determine which niches are going to be profitable and which ones will be losers. The whole point of this keyword game is that the keywords are what people are searching for when they're looking for your book. Unless you're somebody who's already famous, in which case your name alone is a keyword that they would look for, then you're going to need to get deeper into the keyword issue to ensure that you're not making mistakes with those keywords. The impact for me was a huge increase in the number of sales just because of searches that people were doing. So why KDP keywords are so important? Well, the first thing is they are the number one people way people find your book. So when they're first getting started with your book, when you're first getting started and people are looking for a book to read, a topic or something along those lines, they're simply going to type in something into the search engine, keeping in mind that Amazon is perhaps the third largest search engine on earth, only second to Google YouTube then this is the way that people find books. So if you're looking for something on uh, maybe puppy training or you're looking on something on how to bake cakes, they're going to type in cake baking or certain terms. As you start typing those terms into Amazon, you will see that certain keywords start to show up. Where it shows up, it tries to fill out what you're typing. And that gives you an idea of which keywords people are searching. Using a tool like KD Spy, as I mentioned earlier, it then shows you how those keywords rank and in, in terms of how many books are on the market for each of those keywords. And based on that, we're able to determine which keywords are good ones to include in both our seven keywords we choose for KDP, Kindle Direct Publishing, and also the very title of our book itself. Number two, they make it clear what your value proposition is. So it's not only that they find it, but you need to make sure that you word it in terms of what are you delivering? What exactly are you promising to deliver to your audience when it comes to the book contents of your book. And this is something that so many authors overlook. The third thing is, as I was just commenting, is the secret answer of the day that many authors, maybe 90% or more, ignore keywords completely. They choose, try to get clever with keywords or use the seven keywords, use ones that are already in their title. And we need to remember that your title itself is the first search thing that they're gonna look for and it needs to show 
maybe even the very keywords that they have an identical match between what they're searching for and the unique sales proposition that you have in your title. So we're not trying to get super clever with that title, but making sure that it, when they do the search, they see your cover, it comes up and we see that title. It's perhaps the second, first most important thing of any aspect when you're writing the book is the title, then the cover, which then they say, wow, that cover, it's promising to deliver exactly why I was searching in the first place for that keyword. And that's why these keywords are so important and can make the difference between whether your book is discovered or just completely ignored because how else are they supposed to see it? You can run ads, but really it's the searches they're doing that are going to reveal your keywords for you. So this is something you're definitely gonna to want to consider with the books that you're putting onto the market. So are you paying attention to the keywords in your books? If you are, write the word yes below in the comments. If you're not, then write the word no below in the comments so that I can get a better understanding of where you're coming from. And check up above me here for more video answers to your self-publishing questions. Thanks.